Hello, football fans and sports fans of every kind. This is Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, and I'm here again with another game in my Chicago Bears season. Now, as you can see down here in the NFC North, we are 5-1, and one, leading the way by two games over Detroit, who's only 3-3, three and three, and Green Bay is at 1-4, and, and Minnesota's 1-5, and, and we just knocked off Minnesota. Now, if we look at our schedule... You can see we started the year beating Green Bay 38-17. Then we beat Tampa Bay 30-27 in overtime. Then we beat the world champion Kansas City Chiefs 31-14. Then we lost to Denver, surprisingly, 23-17. We beat Washington at pretty much at the buzzer and beat them 22-20 as they were driving. And Minnesota, well, we beat Minnesota 32-14 pretty easily. Uh, we picked off uh, Kirk Cousins in that game, I believe, uh, three or four times. I mean, he had a terrible game. So now we are playing at home against Las Vegas. The Las Vegas Raiders are coming to play. This would be the game of 10-22 on the schedule for 2023. So, without further ado, let's uh, get on with the week. And we will play one week. And you can see up there the second one from the top is our game. So they won't play that. We will. I will. Taking uh, Chicago, of course. The finals are rolling in. For these games and then we will take a quick look at some of the standings see what happened in particularly at NFC North as a result of these games okay so uh, you can see um, Detroit went to three and four so they lost another game so we will maintain our two game lead three three game lead three game lead if we, even if we lose uh, two or three game. I think it was three. Yeah, two. We'll maintain our two game lead over to Detroit even if we lose. Minnesota won. They went to two and five. And Green Bay lost and went to one and five. So, Or either that or they were on a bye week or something. I don't know. But we're ready to play. That's all I know. We're going to launch the game. And I will defer the kickoff for now, and so we will receive the ball first in the second half. We're kicking off to the Raiders here. And that's going to be the Raiders are going to take the touchback. And we will go over the offense for the Raiders. It's going to be at flanker will be Jacob Myers. Along the line they will have tight end Michael Meyer. Then Jermaine Eliumunur, I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh, right guard is Greg Van Rotten. The center is Andre James. The guard is Dylan Parnum. The left tackle is Colton Miller. You've got the second tight end, Austin Hooper. They run an offense similar to the one we run a lot. Uh, split end is Devontae Adams, of course. Um, you've got Josh Jacobs in the backfield as a running back, and they're going to go with Brian Hoyer at quarterback. He only attempted 42 passes in 2023 for a 54.8% completion percentage. Our defense will be left end Montez Sweat, left tackle Justin Jones, free safety is Eddie Jackson, Right tackle is Andre Billings. The right end is Demarcus Walker. At linebacker, you've got Jack Sanborn. Middle linebacker is Tremaine Edmonds. Right linebacker is TJ Edwards. You've got um, Jalen Johnson out at quarterback, a cornerback. Strong safety is Joaquin Brister. And the... Uh, and the right cornerback is Tyreek Stevenson. So with all of those introductions out of the way, we'll get started. I am going to look for the run. 
In fact, I am going to look for the run on the first play and key on Jacobs. I mean, they've got Hoyer at quarterback. Oh, they're going to pass with Hoyer. Holy crap. And, uh, well, we stop him before the first down, but he gets eight yards. Huh. All right. Kind of ballsy there with uh, Hoyer, but we'll see. Uh, I'm going to put in the balanced on second down. And they run it right up the middle. Josh Jacobs takes the ball from Hoyer and runs right up the middle for the first down. I, I'm going to admit, I'm taking the uh, I'm taking the Raiders a little lightly here. In real life, actually, the Bears beat the Raiders, I believe. Uh, I, I think it was our first win of the season, as a matter of fact, in real life. So uh, I'm going to run and key on Jacobs. And uh, if that's Jacobs, I'm going to be a little upset. Yeah, it was. He explodes up the middle for six yards, even though I keyed on him. It must be one good running back. All right, so he's got a first and ten at his 40. Let's try a safety blitz. Let's try something crazy out of the... Uh, oh, that didn't work. That did not work. All right. I'm done playing with the Raiders here. <laughs> Uh, I don't know, but they are doing unexpectedly well. They're moving the ball actually better than most teams have on us. I'll put in the balanced again. Ooh, that was nice. It was e either incomplete or, y yeah, it was complete for minus four yards. Um, I am going to look for the pass. I think it's prudent to look for the pass here. And he is passing. And we're not going to get him. Well, no, we will. We will. We stop him before the first down. But uh, he only has four yards to go. Third and four for the Raiders. At our 27. I'm going to put in the balanced again. I mean, I just can't tell what he's going to do. All right, we got him. We got him in the backfield. Nice. All right, I expect him to kick a field goal. And frankly, I'm surprised they got the field goal range. But anyway, no. Oh, wait a minute. What? Is this really? All right, uh, I'm going to put in the. Uh, I'm going to put in the pass. Fourth and four. He's going for it. And we didn't get him. Oh my God! I can't. Be First of all, I can't believe he went for it. Second of all, I can't believe he got it. All right, I'm going to put in the balanced, and we get him quickly. I should have put in the balance for the fourth and four, but he picks up two yards there. Gonna put in the balanced again. Seems to work well against him. Man, that balanced defense just really he can't he can't figure that one out. But when I'm specifically looking for something that he does, he always gets a lot of yards. Alright, I'm gonna put in the pass defense. So I probably I'm gonna pay for no I'm not, it's incomplete. So let's see. He's got a 4th and 8 now. Let's see if he goes for it on 4th and 8. No, now he wants to kick. I, I don't know what the difference of the one before was as compared to this. But he does kick the field goal and L.A., uh, the Las Vegas, I mean, is up 3 nothing. So, he will kick off to us. We're down 3 nothing, so let's see what we can do with that. I'll take the touchback, even if they give me the option, but they're not even going to give me the option. So, All right, our offense is... Uh, see, we got Badgett in at quarterback this time. Splendid is DJ Moore. 
tight end is uh, second tight end is Robert Tunyon. Left tackle is Braxton Jones. Left guard is Tavon Jenkins. The center is Lucas Patrick. Right guard is Nate Davis. Right tackle is Darnell White. Komet is at tight end. Mooney is at flanker. Herbert is in the backfield at running back. And Badgett is the quarterback. He attempted 143 passes in 2023 for a 65.7 completion percentage. He, I'm guessing, <coughs> I'm guessing the quarter, the uh, computer put him in there because he may have been the quarterback in the Raiders game in actuality. That's all right. We'll uh, we'll go with that. I'm gonna go flat to Tunyon. And I think that was complete. Yep, complete for three yards. So we got a second and seven. I'm going to go line buck with Herbert. And that gets uh, two or three yards as, as well. Yep, another three yards. So we got a uh, third and four coming up. I mean, the big difference here between Badgent and... Uh, um, fields is I can't do that end run for a lot of yards thing. All right, we're going to do a look in pass to the split end. And that's going to be complete for some good yards. He hits DJ Moore for nine yards. Badging. I mean, badging, you know. He's not bad. In fact, let's see if I can bring up his card. Uh, I, I know there's a way to do it uh, in-game, but anyway. Let's try a long here on first down. I'm going to go long to the flanker, see if we can do that, if we can pull it off. Can we pull it off? No. No. Incomplete. Now that sets us a little behind the eight ball now because if we're going to do nickel and dime passes, um, oh, there's a flag on the play and they let us keep playing. I might refuse it if we uh, if it goes against uh, the Raiders. Uh, no, it was against us. So we got a second and 20. I'm going to go short to Tunyon. Oh, he's going to get sacked. And he's going to fumble the ball and lose it. And they're going to score a touchdown. <coughs> well, that was a very bad turn of events. I will put in kick block. So they're going to be up 10 nothing. Just like that, they're up 10 nothing. And trying to work our way back into this game with a nickel and dime passing quarterback is going to be difficult. To say the least. All right, that'll be a touchback. I'll go look into Tunyon. <coughs> and that was good for a first down. So we have a first and 10 at our 35. I'll go short to Mooney. Oh, he's out on his own running, and he's doing a pretty good job of it, too. He got eight yards. So Badgett runs the ball and gets eight. <coughs> 
Second and two, I'm going to go line buck with Herbert. And he's going to get the first down and more. He gets six, as a matter of fact. So we got a first and 10 at our 49. I'll do a look in pass to Foreman. Oh, they intercepted. Are you kidding me? Oh my God. This is crazy. We're getting schooled by the Raiders. Now, again, I want to also point out, this is maybe a good time to point this out. If we get in a situation where we're getting killed, I will just quick play the game. Hey, Alexa, that's enough. I will quick play the game um, to a certain point and then just play it from there so that the video is shorter and we don't have to sit through an, an, an agonizing loss. As Brian Hoyer completes another pass. Hoyer is 7 of 8 today for 46 yards. I mean, that's crazy. All right, I'm going to go with the balanced on 2nd and 6. And it's incomplete. He was looking for Zamir White on that one, and he did not get him. I'm going to go with the balanced again. Now, if we hold them to a field goal here, it's still only 13 nothing. Yeah, I expect them to kick a field goal here and make it 13 nothing. Well, we're down by just two touchdowns. Ooh, they're going for it. All right, I'm going to go balanced this time. Fourth and six, and he's going for it. And now I intercept it, and I'm going to try to get some yards. What the heck happened? They're replaying this. Okay. All right, I don't know what happened there. It's like they replayed it and a little differently. And asked if I wanted to gain some yards, and I did, so they just kind of redid it. And I have seen that happen before. So, <coughs> fortunately, he didn't score there. So, we're going to go flat to Foreman. And it's incomplete. And the reason I'm, another reason I'm sticking with Badgent is because there is a possible overuse um, issue with fields if I kept playing fields to where they would just make sure I couldn't use fields, I think. So we want to make sure we don't get in that situation. Because as you remember, fields did miss some games in 2023. All right, we're going to go look in pass to more. And it's complete for a lot of yards. And we are just closing in on the end of the uh, first quarter. 15-yard gain there for more. Nineteen seconds left. Let's launch it. I'm going to launch to Mooney. Let's see if he can complete this one. He cannot. It's incomplete. So one second left in the first quarter. I'm going to go short to uh, more. It's incomplete. Now we've got a third and ten. Got to go short pass. I'm sure the Raiders know that. We're going to go short to Scott. 
No, they know it, and they're going to sack him. At least he didn't fumble the ball this time. So we're entering the second, we are in the second quarter, and we're losing 10 nothing, and we will punt. That's a nice punt. Uh, they're they're going to take over at their 12-yard line. We do have a pretty good punter. So I don't know why the Bears drafted one in real life. But anyway, I'm going to go balance. He just can't seem to solve the balance defense. And we stop him after a 9-yard gain. And I will look for the run and key on Jacobs. Nope, he's passing. And we get him after he gets a lot of yards. That's the story of the game. Hoyer is looking like Joe Montana here. He's 9 of 13 for 64 yards. I'm going to do a linebacker blitz. I mean, i got to pull out something here. All right, interception. I'm going to um, try to gain some yards. And we do get it back to the 25. So Hoyer's been picked off twice. So uh, All right, so we're going to go flat pass to Scott. And he catches it for eight yards. Going to go looking past Komet. I don't know if that was complete. Yeah, it was for five yards. Nice. In traffic, Komet makes the catch. We got a first and ten at the Las Vegas twelve. <coughs> I'm gonna do a look in to Lewis. And I think that was complete too. For only two yards. Going to do a flat pass to Herbert. Yeah, he gets a little bit, picks up something. Two yards. Got a third and six. I'm going to go flat. Oh, I can't. All right, so now we're inside where I can't do a flat pass. Probably not a look in either, yeah. So we're going to go short to more. And it's intercepted. Come on. Well, we had at least three points, but uh, no, not going to happen. So Vegas is going to have it at their 20. I'm going to look for the pass. He is passing at least. That's good. <coughs> Incomplete. Now I'm going to look for the balanced. Again, he seems to have issues stopped. Oh, we're offsides. And he'll probably refuse it. So 
So it's uh, first and 10 at his 37. I'm going to look for the pass. Now there's a, another flag. Hopefully this time it's on Vegas. Vegas again now leading 10-0 with 10.03 left in the half. Well, you got to definitely accept the penalty. So now he's got a first and 20 at the 27. I'm going to look for the pass. He is passing. And uh, despite the fact that, he's pa that I knew he was going to pass, he still gets 15 yards on the play. So now they're going to have a second and five. Very doable. I'll put in the balanced. And he completes it. Over the middle for a lot of yards. 16. 16 yard gain there. So he is, Hoyer today is 12 of 18 for 112 yards, but two interceptions. I'm going to look for, I'm going to run and key on white. And he does, and we do get him in the backfield. Zamir White dragged down after a loss of two. I apologize, my cold is still lingering, uh, particularly the cough. So, uh, second and 12, I'm going to look for the balanced. I'm going to put the balanced in. And it's incomplete. Well, he's got a third and 12 coming up. I'm going to put in a pass defense for sure. And in fact, I am going to double team Adams. And it's incomplete. First time we're going to hold him to a punt. I mean, we have gotten turnovers on two interceptions. So we hold him again. It's still only 10 nothing. And, of course, he does a coffin corner, so we're hemmed up at the 7-yard line. First and 10 from our 7. I'll go off tackle with Foreman. Well, he gets a lot of yards, man. Man, is he getting a lot of yards. That was great. Deonta Foreman. Nice 18 yard run. Let's go line buck with Foreman. Let's keep going with that theme. Three yards. So we got a second and seven. I'm going to go short to Scott. Uh, he always gets sacked on a short pass. God. Well, we're not going to get a first down now. Third and 19. Got to go short again and hope for a completion. And it's incomplete. So... We continue to hold the Raiders to just 10, but we can't seem to score on them at all. We were in scoring position once, but uh, Badgett threw an interception in the end zone. And they're going to get a hell of a return here, too. I mean, they're already in field goal range on the return. I'm going to put in the balanced. And 
and he is tackled after five yards. I'm going to put in the run. Nope, he's not running. But we do get him before the first down. So he's got a third and like one or two coming up. Third and two. I'll put in the balanced. And we get him in the backfield. So let's see if he kicks a field goal here. Or tries to go for it. I mean, he likes to go for it. Yep, he's going to go for it. Crazy. All right. I'm going to put in the balanced again. Uh, didn't stop him this time. I don't know. I mean, he's got, I, it doesn't matter what I guess, what I do. I've got a pass defense in right now, and he still completed it for 10 yards. And again, remember, this is Hoyer. This is Brian Hoyer. Hoyer today is 14 of 22 for 125 yards and two interceptions. I'm going to put in the, uh, I'm going to double team, who, Adams. It's incomplete. So we've got a second and ten. I'm going to put in the balanced. And we get him. Probably behind the line. Zero yard pickup right at the line. So we are going to put in the balanced, the dreaded balanced defense. And we get him right before the first down marker which he will probably go for it. Run and key on Jacobs. I mean, uh, that's the only thing you can really do here. And he scores. Brian Hoyer takes the ball himself. On a sneak for a touchdown. And I'll put in the kick block. And they are up 17 nothing. So this is very unlike what I would have expected. We've lost to... Um, well, we've lost to the Denver Broncos, who are one of the wor worst teams in their division. And uh, we're losing to another bad team from 2023. All right, well, first and 10 at our 36 with only 30 seconds left. You know what you got to do. You got to go long to more. Yeah, all right, sack me. I mean, you know. Second and 18 from the 28. One second left. <coughs> you know you're going long. Ooh, he's offside, so the half can't end on a penalty. It's incomplete, but we should have another play. It can't end on a defensive penalty. I will accept it. And we now have a first, a second and 13 at our 33. 
And we're going to go long to more. And he sacked. So that's how the half is going to end. It's going to end 17 nothing Raiders. I think I will bring in Fields in the second half and see if he can do anything. Once we get set, I will look at our statistics. Which are not pretty. So that's a touchback. All right, look at the reports, box score. Hoyer is, is 15 of 24 passing for 134 yards and two interceptions. Badgen is 8 of 15 passing for 54 yards and two interceptions. Jacobs has eight rushes for 17 yards. Abdullah has one rush for five yards. Hoyer has one for two yards on a touchdown. For us, Foreman has three rushes for 25 yards. Herbert has two for 19, and Badgett has one for eight. Okay, we're going to go to Fields. And now I'm going to try a long pass to Moore. Got to get back into this thing. It's incomplete. So we're going to try a short pass with Fields. Short to Mooney. It's incomplete. Well, we got to stay with the short pass for sure. Short pass to Moore. Okay, Fields on the run, on the run, on the run. He doesn't get a lot of yards. Gets one yard. So we are going to punt. And we stop him pretty quickly after he catches it. 46-yard punt with a 4-yard return. I'm going to put in the balanced. And we get him pretty quickly. Just a 2-yard gain. Again, the Raiders were starting the second half here. 13:35 left in the third quarter and they're winning. The Raiders are winning 17-0. Gonna put in the pass, and he runs it. We do get him before the first down marker, though. He gets six, so it's gonna be a third and two. I'm gonna put in the balanced, and that is if it's complete, it's not for a first down. It is complete for a one-yard loss. So I suspect he'll punt, and he will. Twelve forty-three left in the third quarter, and that's going to come to rest at the six-yard line. He keeps pinning us deep too. I mean, to add insult to injury. All right, we're going to try a flat pass to Tunyon. And that's going to be complete for a minus yards. Loss of four yards. Nice. Let's try a look in pass to Moore. That's going to be complete. 
for four yards. <clears throat> All right, we got a third and ten. I'm going to go short to Mooney. Never works, but... It does there, though. Nice. 11 yard gain, just what we needed. I'm going to go line buck with Johnson. Yeah, he gets maybe two yards. Three. Nice. Second and seven. Going to go off tackle with Johnson. He gets some good yards. They must be susceptible to the run. Like very susceptible. Okay, we got a third and two. I'm going to go line buck with Herbert. Yeah, they, uh, they must be weak at the run. All right, we got a first and 10 at the 31. Let's try an off tackle with Johnson. Man, if I'd known this earlier, we would have been in a lot better situation. Because it's not like I got these great running backs. They're doing this. These guys are pedestrian. All right, we're going to go line buck with Johnson. And there is a penalty on the play, probably on us. <coughs> Minus one yard. Oh, no, it's on them, so I'm going to accept the penalty. We have a first and ten at the Las Vegas 49. Let's go off tackle with Johnson. All right, this time he doesn't get anything. Second and 10 at the 49. I'm going to go a look in past Mooney. And that is a good completion there for five yards. Let's go off tackle. Oh, no, I can't go off tackle. Go line buck with Johnson. There is a penalty flag. He got the first down though. Five yards on the first down. But it was on us. So it's a third and 15. We're going to have to go short pass to Mooney. And he does catch it. It's, it's to Komet, though, for 10 yards. We have a fourth and five at the 44 of Vegas. I'm going to go for it. Out of the pro set. I'm going to change to fields, and I'm going to go short pass to Moore. Oh, it's incomplete. I had to gamble there. I mean, we're down 17 with 6-12 left in the third quarter. I'm going to put in the balanced defense. It's incomplete. Going 
Going to put in the pass defense. He does pass, and we do stop him five yards before the marker. He's got a third and four. I'm going to put in the balance defense. And we don't get him in time. I'm going to put in the balanced defense. And we stop him after like five yards. Yeah. Second and five, we're going to go with the run. Nope, he's passing. And it's incomplete. So third and five, I'm going to look for the pass. I'm just going to put in the pass. I'm not going to even double team anybody. And we get him just before the marker. Now let's see if he goes for it. He is. I'm going to put in the run and key on Jacobs. And uh, that's what he does, but we st he still gets some good yards. Gets the first down. I'm going to put in the balance defense. And we stop him from getting the first down there. But he does get six yards. I'm going to put in the run. He does run it, and we do stop him. It's going to be a third and two coming up. Third and two for the Raiders from our 25. I'm going to put in the balanced defense. And it's incomplete. So it's fourth and two. Let's see if he goes for it. I suspect he will. And he will. And I'm going to look for the run. And he's passing. And he made a complete pass for a lot of yards. Gonna look for the pass. It's incomplete. Second and ten at the eleven. I'm gonna look for the pass. And it is complete, but we stop him right there after four, so he's got a third and six. I'm going to put in the balanced. And it's intercepted! I'm going to just keep the ball. All right, we're going to go off tackle with Foreman. And he gets some good yards. If I'd known this earlier in the game that we could run at will on these guys, it would have been a lot different. I'm 
Going to go line buck with Foreman on second and three. And he gets the first down and a little more. And we're in the fourth quarter. I'm going to go flat to Mooney. It's incomplete. Badgett today is 13 of 21 for 80 yards and two interceptions. Going to go line buck with Foreman on second and 10. And look at that. He gets the first down. First and 10 at the Chicago 45. I'm going to go off tackle with Foreman. Foreman is incredible. Foreman today running the ball. Seven rushes for 56 yards, an eight-yard average. I'm going to go... Flat pass to Tunyon. And it's incomplete. I'm going to go off tackle with Herbert. No, he gets caught in the backfield. My bad running backs are guys that are not known for being as good as Khalil Herbert get tons of yards. All right, we got a fourth and four. Uh, I'm going to punt the ball, I guess. But he's saying I should go for it. Probably should, though. Yeah, I'm going to go for it. Looking past to Mooney. And it is complete, so we keep the ball going. I'm going to go off tackle with Foreman. Now, that time they get him pretty quickly. They're on to the foreman thing. I'm going to go flat pass to Moore. And it's incomplete. What were these guys? Excellent against the pass and incredibly poor against the run? I mean, my God. All right, third and eight. Got to try a short pass to Moore. And it is complete for a first down. Off tackle with Johnson. And he's going to get eight yards. Looking pass to Tunyon. And he's going to get a, a touchdown. Nice. Oh, we got seven. We got on the board. I'm 
We're going to kick the extra point. And it is 17 7. Eight fifty four left in the game, and we're down by ten. I'm going to put in the balanced defense. It's incomplete. It's what I need. I need incomplete passes that don't eat a lot of time on the clock. Got to look for the run. Nope, he's passing. Again, it's good that it's Brian Hoyer that he's passing with. Incomplete pass. Now I am going to look for the pass. And there is a penalty on the play. All right, he's punting. I am going to try to catch the ball and gain some yards. And we're instantly in Vegas territory with eight minutes left or less. 742. Going to go off tackle with Johnson. There is a penalty on the play. So we got a first and 20. Going to go line buck with Johnson. And he's going to get a lot of that back. Man, this is crazy. Second and six, I'm going to go off tackle with Johnson. At that time, he only got maybe one or two. Two yards. Got a third and four. Coming right up. I'm going to go off tackle with Herbert. And he's going to get the first down. First and 10 from the Vegas 38. I'm going to go off tackle with Johnson. And he gets good yards. Five-yard gain there. Going to go off tackle with Herbert on second and five. And he gets like three maybe. Yep. Third and two. Going to go line buck with Herbert. He gets just short, but I got to go for it. Actually, you know what? I don't have to go for it. Fourth and one at the Vegas 29. I can kick the field goal and hope I get the ball back. I think that's what I'm going to do. And it'll be up and good. And it is 17-10. We're down by a touchdown. 
I'm going to try an onside kick. Probably didn't get it. So he's got it first and 10 at the Chicago 49. I'm going to put in the balance defense. And it's incomplete. Going to put in the pass defense. He runs it. And he gets a lot of yards. And he's going to eat clock with that. And we do intercept it. Nice. I'm going to try to gain some yards. We don't, but we have the ball. Um, we have the ball back with 222 left. Let's try a short pass to Mooney. And he gets sacked for a one yard loss, something like that. Three yards. Man. All right, I'm going to do a a line buck with Herbert. He gets some good yards. Six yard gain there. Going to do a well, I'm going to go flat to Mooney, I guess. And he catches it and does that thing where he beelines for the. See, that's the problem. I, I don't know how to override that. I know there's a way to override that like tendency to go right for the sidelines late in the game. But I don't know how to do it. I'm going to use our second timeout. And I'm going to go short to more. It's incomplete. And now they got it first. I didn't realize that was fourth down. All right. I am just going to quick play the game. Auto play to zero minutes. And that's that. So we lost the game, and we are now 5-2. and two. Still have a two-game lead over Detroit, three-game lead over Minnesota. But we've lost our second game of the year and go to 5-2, and two. and that is it for me, Sportsman Z, Bob Zolke, signing off.